Hi everyone, okay, so today's look I'm going for is another holiday series, still continuing on with that. Um, I'm doing a naughty smoky eye look, so yeah, this is that, it's just black, gray, silvers, um, a very nude concealed lip, it kind of reminds me of porn starish, so that's naughty. <laughs> and for my face, you can't really tell because the lighting in here sucks. I have just bronzer on my cheeks, and I promise you I'm really, really not this white I'm actually pretty I'm light like I'm really white I'm a really white Mexican I'm really white like I'm pale but compared to Mexicans but I'm not this white um I'm, I have a little bit of tan to me so yeah uh with all that said let's just go ahead and get this all started okay so for the first thing I did I primed my eyes with Too Faced Shadow Insurance Primer and the next thing that I am going to do is I'm going to take a black aqua color wet makeup um, to use as my base for the smoky because I want it to be really dark and then fade really well. So for the lid, I'm just going to put the black aqua color and I'm going to spray my synthetic brush with Max Fix Plus. And you want to make sure that you get the liner part too. So if you want to do the lining first, go ahead, whatever you feel comfortable with, and then just apply it to, you know, that dent right here where you feel the lid, here the inside of your eyeball, up to there. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that. Okay, so once you have the aqua color painted on your lid like that, I'm just going to go in with a, um, a pencil shape brush, and this is for the brush that I got from the, um, from my crown brush set so I'm just gonna go in there and just kind of smooth out the edges you want to smoke it out okay so now that I have that I'm gonna go in with as soon as I can find it my 88 palette and I'm gonna take this this gray color right here it's the second one right there and it's like a metallic silverish color I'm gonna go in with my 224 224 and it's the black um, fluffy brush and I'm just gonna take that brush and dip it right into that and I'm just gonna do like the highlight not the highlight but the the my crease right there and just have it so that once that black fades out it'll have that silvery color because usually I always fade it into like a brownish color but for the holidays I think silver is more a little bit more festive and then for under that right above it right underneath that I'm gonna take this silver and that brownish color and I'm just going to go in with my brush again and put that right above that black that I had so that it still has at least you know two different um, shades of gray to blend into Next, I'm going to take my um, SS239, and it's just a flat shader brush. Not flat, but it's just an um, eyeshadow brush. And I'm going to take Sugar Pills Bulletproof, my favorite matte black, and I'm just going to dip my brush right into that. Just dip my brush right into that and place it right exactly where I put the aqua color. And then kind of drag it up a little bit. It's totally fine to do that. Because we're just going to end up blending it out. So then I'm going to take my SS217. And it's just the fluffy blending brush. Dip it very lightly in back into the Bulletproof from Sugar Pill. And tap off the access. And then right where that ends, just start fluffing and blending it out. This is the smokiness of it. Now I'm just going to go back in with my 224. And with the 224, I'm going to go back in with both those silvers and grays that I had used. So I'm going to go and take both of them right now and just blend it out. I'm going to go back in with the black aqua color. And um, I'm going to take that synthetic brush that I used earlier for the lid and I'm just going to go ahead and place that right on the lower lash line to line it and then we're going to set it again with the bulletproof 
So once you have that, I'm just going to take my um, smudger brush from Crown Brush. This is from the Luna series. And I'm just going to go right back into Bulletproof from Sugar Pill. And just dip my brush in there. And then just smudge it out. It'll set and smudge it. With the motions like this of just going really quick like sketches, it'll smudge it out perfectly. So just do that. So once you have that, you're going to want to go ahead, tight line, and... Um, line your waterline. So I'm going to go ahead and do that right now. Just go ahead and apply the mascara. And I'm just going to use my most favorite one, the Big Lash from Mascara. I'm um, Mascara. From Maybelline. Just apply it. And I'm going to apply liner and lashes, but I'm going to do the liner last because I want to place my lashes first. And I'm using those lashes right there. They're the number, as soon as I find them, I'll tell you. I'm going to use the number 42s that I got from daisiesbeauty.com. So they look just like that. And my eyes are short this way, so I have to trim them. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to add my lashes, my face, my eyebrows, and I'll go ahead and be back and we'll finish. Okay, so because the lighting sucks, you can't see. I added bronzer and my face powder and foundation and everything. Like I said, my hair is messed up because I have just gotten out the shower. And in the pictures, my hair will be done, so no worries. Um, so to finish off the look, I'm just going to do my lips. And what I'm going to do is my lip brush from a um the crown brush set that i got and i'm going to go in with um sorry i gotta shake it up with occ's lip tart in complex and it's a really um nude um almost concealer like color but it definitely has i want to say like a pinkish beige tone to it so I'm going to go ahead and a, just a little tiny bit. I'm just going to block out the color a little bit. Okay, so once you have that, you're going to want to add a um, lip gloss or a lipstick, whatever you want. I'm going to go in with a lip gloss and I'm going to use um, Devishly Stylish from the Max Minimus Villains lip gloss collection. And this is from uh, the Cruella de Vil one. So I'm going to go in with that. So that is the look. Um, there's the finished product. Like I said, the lighting in here sucks. So one, I look completely pale and I'm not. Um, my foundation color is NC27 in Studio Tech and I use C3 in um, Studio Fix for my powder. So I'm really not this white. Um, my settings on my lighting suck and just the fact that I'm recording off my eyesight kind of makes me look pale because <laughs> I'm not getting proper camera, I guess. So that is the look. Um, pictures and everything will be up. Bye. California.